Alright, Shalom. I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Rakakadash, double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Salutations to the Lord's hope for elect scattered abroad, teaching his word of sincerity and truth. Shalom. Alright, I'm the brother Taz of War. And uh, just back at you again with another lesson. This one is going to be a quick hit. And uh, once again, I'm in a, a Bible app that gives um, that gives uh, a verse of the day. And uh, for two days straight, you know, this uh, Bible app, you know, been on point for a quick hit, you know, for a verse of the day. Because it's dealing with the times, you know, and with, with what, we're, uh, what we're in, okay? So this is uh, Mark chapter 8 and 35. It says, For whosoever will save his life shall lose it. But whosoever shall lose his life for my sake and the gospels, the same shall save it. All right. So, you know, this is uh, maybe could be a, stu it's a stumbling block, you know, to those who are unlearned and that rest wrestle with the scriptures. But, you know, it's as clear as day what Yahweh Shai is saying, you know, for those who understand, which is of the hopeful elect. And he's saying, for whosoever will save his life shall lose it. So if you think that you're going to save your life in this God forsaken world, which the Lord is purposely destroying the economy. All right. By an agenda that was thought that was given to these elites to act on. All right, for this world dominance of uh, digital currency, so they could uh, be as though they the Most High, you know, sit upon the stars of the Most High, as the scriptures say, was that Isaiah 14, and uh, this delusion, you know, that the Most High put upon these Edomites, you know, is all to fulfill the Heavenly Father's agenda, which is to give Jacob the kingdom, okay, here on earth, as as it says in the prayer. Uh, here on earth as it is in heaven so if you think to save your life and how do you try to save your life today you will you know you you'll be a part of the world you know you thinking about you know the future of probably getting rich because you know it's said you know a lot of people get rich around a time of a crisis or a so-called pandemic you know if you invest right put your money you know and come be creative you know create a company you know selling products or whatever 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 it may be you know you might be you know preparing yourself for a doomsday destruction you know a lot of Edomites are going out to the woods you know because the election is coming up and I believe they talking about you know having heavily guarded police on the street maybe military you know to prevent a civil 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 war you know for whoever win or lose you might be uh you know you know ordering like crazy all sorts of foods online you know to how you know things to uh survive in the woods and you know bug out bags and things like that you know you might be somebody that been planning to save your life from an economy crash maybe years ago you might got a warehouse back with food you know you stockpiling on guns and training your children to uh learn how to how to fight you know all in the name of saving your life you know you might consider joining esau you know you're going to take that chip the mark of the beast you know you're going to do that to save your life because eventually you're going to be threatened okay by this system the image of the beast okay you're going to be threatened by the system and by esau all right because he the ones that run the system you're gonna be threatened with your life, you know, to either take this chip, take that mark, all right, which the mark is the RFID microchip, you know, in order for you to survive. You know, you're gonna be pressured, you know, tempted, because why? You know, your children gotta eat. If you got children, you gotta eat. You know, you might, you know, need to, you know, keep a steady job to pay your bills. You might, you know, on you on your own, you know? So, there's all sorts of ways, you know, carnally, when you think about it, on how you can save your life in this, uh, in Esau's world. So, Yahweh Shai said, for whosoever will save his life shall lose it. Meaning, you're going to lose it. Because at the end of the day, all right, you take that mark, 
that chip. The scriptures speak how the great destruction that's going to destroy America, which is known as Babylon the Great, is going to turn this place into a lake of fire. And that's by the way of thermonuclear fire. So you're going to be, you're going to die anyway. You're going to lose your life. All right. You try to bury yourself uh, under the ground, 10, six feet under or whatever. You know, you're basically burying yourself to your death. All right. You join Esau's military, you know. You uh you 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 for Esau's agenda because you want a comfortable comfortable life. You want your family to be comfortable, you know. The scriptures say in Isaiah 13, he that is joined unto him shall be thrust through. So it says, For whosoever will save his life shall lose it. But whosoever shall lose his life for my sake and the gospels, the same shall save it. So losing your life in this world. Is uh, going into what Apostle Paul said in uh, Romans 12 and 1 and 2. Uh, Give thy body as a living sacrifice, you know, which is our reasonable service. You know, giving your body over to a living sacrifice to Yahweh Bashem Shai in the gospel is that you refrain from this world. You know, that's the first start. You know, set, set, setting yourself apart from the wickedness. You know, doing right, rehearsing righteous acts, praying, you know. Being on one accord with the Lord, you know, sacrificing your your uh, your desires, your pleasures, you know, not doing the things that you your flesh may want you to do, and if it's wrong, you sacrifice, you you, you kill that, you kill the flesh, you know, you don't do it, you know. Uh, also, too, when it comes down to it, all right, for each uh, brother sister, if it comes down to it, you know, that you're facing death. You know, you would, you would give your body as a living sacrifice. You know, fuck it, man. All right? This flesh got to go. This the way the Lord has it going down. Then, I, then, then it so be. All right? To wop. Okay? Because why? We know the mystery. That all shall not sleep. Okay? We know that this is the end. We know that the chariots of the Lord is coming with Yahweh Shai and the angels to deliver the elect. We know that those that died in Yahweh Shai is going to be risen first. In those chariots And then those that are alive Caught up together And we're never going to be set apart From Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai So we know the mystery We know uh, The Lord told us He said before things uh, uh, Spring up I tell you of them uh, Another scripture come in mind He said he telleth his secrets To the servants the prophets So but whosoever shall lose his life For my sake and the gospel, which the gospel mean good news, right? The same shall save it, you know? And that's for those of the hopeful elect who have faith. You know, if you wrestle with that, you know, because of fear, you know, because of not un understanding, you gotta pray to the Lord for understanding. You gotta pray for the Lord to take away that fear of man. You know, the Lord said, fear not man, but fear him who can kill the body, soul, and hell, all right? You supposed to fear Yahweh Bashem Shai, not fearing Esau and what he could do to your flesh You're supposed to fear the Lord Okay, the Heavenly Father Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai Okay, the Son of the Most High So, you know, hopefully This lesson's edifying, like I said, it's a verse of the day uh, It's a quick hit I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai Bahashem Rakakwadash Double honors to my apostles and elders Of great millstone who rule well Salutations to the Lord's elect, Shalom Pray for strength And faith